Heroes of the Dorm 2016 is upon us, and we wanted to take a moment to walk you through what to expect from this year's viewing experience as we broadcast again live on ESPN2. Just like last year, we have built a custom observer interface. However, this year, we've made a few improvements. We heard your feedback loud and clear and set to work creating a new custom minimap that will remain visible throughout the broadcast. This small top-down view is unique to each battleground and will display all relevant team structures, battleground objectives, including which team has possession, and the current location of all heroes. Just beneath the minimap sits the scoreboard. This is your central hub for active information. Here we give you a quick look at the hero compositions that make up each team, including individual health bars, and a heroic indicator that will light up when a heroic ability is available for play. Also new this year is the addition of death timers that will show the amount of time remaining before a hero that's been taken out of the fight can jump back in. Moving towards the inside, here we will show you the current team level, as well as a visual indicator that depicts how much experience the team has earned towards the next level. In the middle of the scoreboard, we will surface information relevant to the battleground itself, including a summary of the objective status, upcoming map timings, core health, and a summary of team takedowns and fortifications remaining. We hope this year's interface will keep you locked in step with the exciting moment-to-moment -moment gameplay brought to you by these amazing collegiate teams. Please let us know what you think and how we can make things even better for future broadcasts. We'll see you in the Nexus.